The next question will be, I actually want to watch this edit while I'm editing. How do I do that? Well, on this laptop, I don't have any extra hardware attached to it. So I can just double click to it and just whack it up full screen and I can play it back, but it's not perfect. It's all like any old computer screen playback. Now my laptop's only got an HD screen. We do have some laptops with some 4K screens. There's a 15 inch version of this very laptop for which has got a 4K screen. But ironically, they don't have a 4K screen for the 17 inch laptop. Sooner or later they'll actually make one, but right now we can't buy one. So on this laptop, I can't actually see my 4K footage at full red quality. Now if I had two screens plugged in here, I could stick a 4K screen on the laptop and then get this to play back on the 4K screen. The laptop itself has got two display ports and an HDMI port at the back. So if I use the display port, I can actually do a very good 4K picture out of the laptop onto a 4K screen. It'll still be a computer graphics card playback. It won't be a proper video playback, but it's the best option that we've got on the laptop. On a desktop, we can use some extra hardware. We've either got Thunderbolt devices or PCIe devices. Now the Thunderbolt devices we've got are from Blackmagic. It's the Thunderbolt Ultra Studio 4K, which can do all the resolutions, including 4096, and it can work at 50 and 60p. None of these devices that actually work at 50 or 60p can do 50 or 60p with EDIUS yet. They only work with a couple of other programs. So if you're actually editing at 50 or 60p 4p, you can't get that out of a video gizmo at the moment with EDIUS. There's also a new Blackmagic gizmo coming out called the Ultra Studio 4K Extreme, which is basically the same kind of thing as the Ultra Studio 4K, but it has a couple of extra codecs on board, and it'll also do 12G SDI. Now you could use these Thunderbolts gizmos on laptops with Thunderbolt. Now we do actually have some Thunderbolt laptops, but it's not quite as powerful because it's using a laptop processor. So with this laptop, I've got a desktop processor, I can play stuff back, I can do cuts, I can do color correction, I can almost do a picture in picture. On the Thunderbolt enabled laptop, it's not quite as good, which is why for 4K editing, we'd say go for the desktop laptop, because with 4K processing powers is what you need. All the 4K Blackmagic devices are either Thunderbolt or PCI. So we talked about the Thunderbolt ones, they've also got some PCIe ones. The cheapest one is the Blackmagic Intensity Pro 4K. This is about £130 and it will output video resolutions up to UHD. So obviously it does standard def, it does high def, it does high def at 50 and 60p and it does UHD. It does 3860 by 2160, it doesn't do the other resolution 4096 by 2160. But you know, it's £130. The next step up you've got is the Decklink Studio 4K, which is similar to the intensity, but it's got SDI as well, and it does full 4K. And then beyond that, you've got the Extreme 4K, which will do 50 and 60p 4K, whereas the others are limited to 25p. 